Thanks for joining me. This is Danny. Welcome to the All the Muds subscriber server. I am here all by myself. <laughs> Sadly, I'm not entirely alone though, um, because as you can see in the chat activity, there are some other people playing. Um, but everybody's playing on the other server right now, on the um, 1.10.2 Cyrenus server uh, with the Cyrenus mod pack, and I am playing on this server today. Elpec, unfortunately, is ill today. Um, but I have a few things that I want to do. Um, while Elpec is away, kind of, and then I have some, and then we have some plans for when he gets back. So what I want to do today, actually, <laughs> ultimately what I want to do is I want to start building our base. Um, but before I start building our base, there are two things that I want to do um, before I get to that. Uh, one, uh, I want to finish, I want to get us some canola power, we, canola oil power. Um, Elpec set up this huge canola farm, and he's using the Actual Editions Farmer, and we are getting tons of canola, and canola seeds. And, uh, in fact, and, but nothing is automated at this point, except for, of course, the farmer itself, but I have to pull, <laughs> pull the canola out of here, and put it in there. Um, and then, of course, it starts working again, because now it has room to put canola. And we're not doing anything with the canola, it's just sitting here in this drawer. Um, so, you know, what's the point if we're not going to use it? <laughs> so, it'll be pretty easy for me to basically set this up to uh, start generating RF for us, because the only RF generation we have right now are these coal generators, and we don't really have a good source of coal. I mean, we don't have a tree farm yet um, for charcoal, and I keep running out and then having to manually cut down another tree, and... Um, we've got a really easy source of, of RF right there, so I might, we may as well get it started. And then, once we have a decent source of RF, I'd like to get a quarry set up in the mining dimension, um, which is an extreme hills dimension, basically the whole thing is extreme hills, so... Um, so that will be very nice, because, you know, <laughs> we've been playing playing at this for a while, and, and, you know, we're still hardly have any diamonds and we're still kind of scrounging around for different resources and manually mining and all that stuff so that is going to change today and then um, and then I'm going to start on a build um, depending on how much time I mean that may end up being in the next episode but um, I'm going to start on a build that's going to be like a um, the, what I have in mind is kind of a Scottish Highlands house kind of thing or a, or maybe like kind of a Highlands mansion and, you know, since we're up here in the Highlands, um, I think it would make a lot of sense. And even if we plant kind of spruce trees around it and stuff, it'll kind of have that sort of uh, Scottish Highlands look <laughs> and, and a different kind of architecture than that I have never really played around with before. So, so that should be kind of fun. Um, now, I plan on kind of doing a, ba a real basic build. It's going to be kind of big. I think I'm kind of planning on making a larger house, um, but I'm going to leave a lot of the detail work to when Elpec is back because um, I think I think we do a really good job when we work together. Um, we re we do a really good job at detail work when we work together, like with the stuff that we did at Spawn. Um, so I'm just going to do kind of the basic stuff, and I'm I'm pointing over there because I'm thinking I'm going to build it there, um, or I might just do it here. Actually, this spot is pretty nice too. I would obviously cut down that tree and um, I really what I really wanted to do is I wanted to build it on that hill but the problem is because we have a we have a 10 um, chunk whoa, render distance on the server um, when we're up here we can't see anything. <laughs> There's really no view we can't see down to the bottom so otherwise this would be a perfect spot but yeah We'll just we'll just do it down here because this is a really nice view here too. So I need a canola press. Oh. Nori crystal. I thought we had some somewhere. Setting up oil. Yeah, yeah. Canola oil. Well, actually, I'll make. I'm gonna take it to oil oil, <laughs> like regular oil, I'll for, with the fermenting thing. But that's that's as far as I'm gonna go. I'm actually gonna let Alpec um, set up the automation because he he did do a video where he set up automation for the higher tier um, canola oils using um, just vanilla redstone. So, 
So I'm going to let him do that. And then after he does it, I'm going to redo it. <laughs> I'm going to replicate what he does using Super Circuit Maker. <coughs> All right, can all press? I'll just get that started. I don't suppose this can pull out of nearby inventories, can it? No. Oh, and it needs RF. Are you I'll just replace one of these? Oh, nice. And he dropped it. Okay. Yes. So that's pulling oil out of the press. Cool. Oh, I don't really want it to do that, though. Because I want to make oil, oil. <laughs> fermenting barrel? Yeah, fermenting barrel. So a Hello. bunch of wood, another inori. Hello. Hey, Boski. Basquiat? Oh. How's it going? Tired? Good. Yeah. yeah, I I do so much in the day. Like, I should be an adult. <laughs> oh, that's right. I didn't you say you were doing um, you're like trying to do two years of school in one year. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm taking my. I'm trying to take my sophomore and my junior year of high school. Oh, high school! Year. Wow, oh. really? So I could be in college a year early. Yeah. And then I'm also I'm also semi pro at Call of Duty to at least have practice. And then I also play soccer. <laughs> and I take, and of course on top of everything, you have to take a few AP classes, so you're working on resumes. Wow. Craziness. Okay, nice. And that makes a fluid laser relay. And that makes an item laser. Oh, I need more than one. Okay, item interface. Oh, that's not going to pull directly from there. What if? Oh, yeah. I forgot to. Oh my god. Okay, back. <laughs> Alright, so then I just put a hopper there. And nothing is happening. Oh, because I didn't put a laser relay on it. Okay. And we connect that to this. Yay, it's working. OK, so now it's just pulling it directly from the farm. But it would be nice if I could get this involved, this drawer. Oh my god, I have two ender pearls. Hooray, builder block. Now I need a quarry card, which is probably going to be the most expensive part of this. Yeah, a diamond pick and a diamond shovel. That is almost all our diamonds. Good thing I'm making a builder block. Oh, somebody else is on the server! <laughs> that's, that's weird. I guess they just weren't, like, reading it. Really yeah, I guess not. I know we're like on that server that you're playing on. What? I I know we're like six water temples. Oh yeah. Oh nice. Have you found any of the um, the forest ones yet? The mansion. I think that's no. only in roofed forests. Yeah. Now I have a quarry. Now I just have to get power to the quarry. Power to the quarry. How about. I'd really like to do the RF tools power cell. Yeah, that's what I did. Yeah, I don't know if I have the resources for it. See, a diamond and emerald. Do I even have an emerald? Oh, I think I got emerald. Didn't I get some emeralds from the... Oh, I didn't. Oh, I do have an emerald, though. Oh, that's right, because we live in an extreme hills. I mean, in a uh, <laughs> highlands. Yep. I have more emeralds than I have diamonds. And then I need a diamond. I have one diamond left. Oh, boy. Oh, I have to make two. Go. I have to make two of them. Right. Crap. Okay, I guess I'm going to go do a little mining. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make one. I'm going to fill it up. I'm going to bring it out to the quarry. Do a bunch. Let it. Let it run dry. <laughs> and then. I'll probably have some diamonds to make another one. Mm, will it last that long? Or will it just. I don't know. If I do a small enough area so that I can yeah. get down to bedrock. Can, the builder can... actually holds, I think, more, doesn't it? 
Oh, that's right. The builder holds a ton so of you RF. Could, you could yeah. charge with the builder first. <laughs> yeah, the builder holds 10 million. Yeah, I'll just set it right here on top of this laser relay. Because the cell only holds a million, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do that. Nitwit and an illager? What's an illager? So the illagers are the the mobs that are in the uh, forest uh, mansions. The, like the spellcaster and the... What's it called? Revenant or something? I can't remember what it's called. They're basically evil villagers. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I read about it. I read about them, but I don't remember much about it. Okay, I have one power cell. Um, and I, I probably shouldn't even have bothered making it yet. Holy crap. Yeah, it's going to take forever to fill up this builder. I'm going to have to have some way to regulate this so that it doesn't suck all our power. That sucks. Yeah. Well, that's not hard. I, I can just use an R RF monitor. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Yeah, that's actually pretty cheap. So I now have two power cells. Hooray! Because I went mining. Now I need to make two cards. I'm missing redstone. Yeah, it's really there. Oh, good. Oh, cool. Oh. Um. Why is it only doing one? So I need more gold. There we go. Oh, crap. Oh, I know. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this power cell here. I'm going to have it in on all sides, but out on the top, which means I need a wrench. Darn it. Yeah, they already know what the problem is. Oh, good. It's, cool. uh, it's a problem with, uh, with the chunk, oh, the chunk, provider, chunk provider overworld. And the chunk provider generator problems are funny. Uh -oh. Yeah, I would he was imagine. Also saying the end city was being blocked too. Oh, that is a smart wrench. That is not a laser wrench. It is. It was for a while. Oh, okay. Because oh, <laughs> I was gonna say I've been seeing them all over the place. Well, actually, not in one eleven. I haven't. I haven't checked. <clears throat> Cool, we now have power storage. Not very much power storage, but power storage. I've got my builder, I've got my power cell, I've got my link card, and what else did I want? I got the shape card. Oh yeah, the RF monitor. So we don't end up draining all our power. Do you have uh, item transfer? Oh, I need chunk loading. Oh. Oh, and item transfer, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I suppose I could just have a big inventory out there, and we could go get it. Because item transfer would require a lot of ender pearls. Yeah, Not so dark and scary mining dimension. Hooray. Oh, somebody has a chunk loader out here. Maybe I'll just... <laughs> Share. Yeah, I'll, I'll just go near them. I mean, like, your builder block could be, like, infinite numbers away from your actual... Does oh yeah. No li limit. I thought it had a limit of like 512 blocks. Is it? Is, is it, it limitless? Is it 512? I don't know. But uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna put. It's it. I know it's a very large range. If if there is a limit, I'm just gonna. I mean, like even if it is, like like he just said, like that's still really large. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I didn't make my RF monitor thing. Oh well. Uh, oh crap. <coughs> All right. So I'm gonna put this. Power cell card in here, so now they're linked. Do you need a bunch of them to make an enderpearl? Yeah. Yeah. Like, they'll drop essence, clear, and then clear. I'm pretty sure this new enderpearl zone system. The new what? Enderpearl zone system, where, like, it has a timer. Oh, it does? I haven't, I didn't even try yet. Enderpearl throwing system? Yeah, like, if you throw one, you have to wait, like, a second for it to throw. Oh, really? That's been in since 110. Oh, yeah, I never throw under pearls, I guess. 
At least not on purpose. <laughs> the only time I ever throw Ender Pearls is by accident. And also, it's like that for the quest group too. Yeah. Hmm. Like when I'm, uh. Ah, oh crap. When I'm right clicking Ender Pearl, uh. or Ender Lilies. Oh, yeah, then you accidentally press <laughs> too fast. Yeah, yeah. And I end up throw throwing the Ender Pearl that I just picked. <clears throat> right about here. Have you ever played the um, um, the thing where like you had to try and get all the achievements without moving and you only use question um, without moving? Mm -hmm. That's impossible. <laughs> you know, what you do? It's like it has. It's like a command block thing, and you it, like you have infinite course fruit. And you just like teleport around with course fruit. Oh, without okay, but you can teleport. You just can't. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wait, course fruit lets you teleport? Red slime just snuck up on me. I thought it was a creeper. You scared the crap out of me. <laughs> oh, this is the offset from. Uh, this is complicated. How are you at seventy three? Are there parts that are on hills or something? No, I just I pillared up because I want to get all the trees too. Oh, okay. Actually, you know what I'm going to do to make this easy? Or I'm just going to dig down to bedrock so I don't have to do any math. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can get out of here with my grapple hook. Isn't that grapple hook the best thing ever? Yeah. Magnetic grappling hook is annoying. It's annoying? Whoa! Ooh, oh crap. Okay, so I the made magnetic it. Magnetic one? I haven't used that one. I almost made it all the way to the surface. The magnetic one is annoying. Oh, that's the one. Oh crap. Can you sleep again? <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. I can't sleep because I'm still in the mining dimension. That's the one where you need the force field to make. So it's like a skyblock, so when it explodes, it like completely resets the hardware. Oh no. <laughs> Cause I'm not that far into it yet. Yeah. Hooray! Oh, look at all this good stuff coming in. <clears throat> yeah, it's the best. Yeah, it's so fast too. Like when it when it's first full of power. So you don't mind if I use a bunch of your RF? Yeah, that's fine. Actually, um, are you doing payless? Yeah. Put it in the uh, <laughs> chest there. Put all your ingredients in the chest. It'll automatically oh, do cool. it. It's the you one recipe it. I have set up. <laughs> automatically put it in there. For nice. I need it for the greenhouse class. Cool. Was that all the ingredients? Yeah, it must be because it's going. I was like, I am not sitting here slowly doing 27 of these things. Yeah, yeah. It's very pretty. Yeah. Oh, I got what I was trying to make. Looks like the particles are a little bit more tame than they used to be. Yeah, they're not as like... Oh, because the lasers are here now. Mm-hmm. Cool. Hooray. Oh, shit. I think it went in my system. <laughs> I what? forgot about that part. You tricked me. <laughs> You're all like, oh, yeah, you can come over and use my empower. <laughs> there you go. <clears throat> You're not going to get your stuff, but <laughs> thanks. In abundance and waste stuff. Yeah. Well, then you have to use that weird... Fluid, what is it called again? Yeah, well, I mean, originally you just had to use the, the um, nutrient fluid, but then they made it so you had to use fluid that was basically liquid diamonds and liquid emeralds. And I'm like, that yeah. is insane. I'm not burning emeralds just to run the system. Oh, wow. It, like, grew instantly as soon as I put the greenhouse glass up. Oh, nice. <clears throat> Holy crap, it's fully grown <laughs> already. really fun about that. Yeah, that glass is amazing. Wow. Uh, That's... Like, it was 0% that whole time, and now, mm -hmm. like, I just placed it, like, a few minutes ago. Now, how do I harvest it? Right-clicking it. You just damage it. You just break just destroy it? destroy it. Okay. Like, yeah, like old style. Okay. So I got an Enderman Essence. I didn't get a seed, though. Oh, there, oh seed. there it is. There it is. I was okay. going to say, because you actually have a chance of getting another seed, and that's when it starts to really shine, is when you can get more, yeah, more seed. Yeah, yeah. Snafu on my map. I went Obsidian Mining, so I could make a Chunk Loader from a Chunk Loader. Mm-hmm. Well, sort of. I'm sort Holy of crap. inside of the mountain. This is a really big item. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the uh, chunk loader item is as big as the block. Like when you're holding it, it's like block sized. 
crazy. Yay, I got my four ender pearls, and I now have five ender pearls. Nice. Thank you very much for that. Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, I now have six ender pearls. Oh, where did I get that one? Well, you killed an enderman and got two pearls, right? Yeah, but I used one of them. I must have already had one that I didn't even... Okay. Oh, oh you know what? I did know about that. I was going to... Okay, whatever. All right, I guess I'm going to make another chunk loader. See if I can make an RNF monitor while I'm outside during a blood moon. I'm surprised I haven't seen any mods yet, or mobs yet. I see the ring of Moran spawn. Oh, really? Just sneaking up yeah. on you. Huh. wonder why there aren't well, any here. I'm going to attack the Sunderman even though I'm probably going to die, but I will. Oh, actually, you know what you should do is go in the hotel, go into one of the... Oh, that looks so cool. Oh, looking over the valley, and it's all red down there, and there's so many mobs. Wow. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, the balcony in the hotel. It's an awesome place to kill Enderman. Yeah, I just got him. He only took me down to three hearts. Oh, nice. You mean you mean he took three hearts, or he took you down to three hearts? He oh. took me down to three hearts. Oh, yeah. wow. I, I almost died. Yeah. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna break this. Oh shoot! Whoops. So like the tin and stuff, the tech reborn spawns in. That's pretty much useless at the moment. Um. Well, I guess so. I mean, unless you want to play tech reborn for the sake of playing tech reborn, but it doesn't seem to be compatible with um, forge energy. Even though I think pretty sure it's supposed to be. I mean, it's it, it says it uses forge energy. That's the only thing it says it uses. Like it doesn't say EU or anything. But unless I'm just I might just be stupid. <laughs> yeah. I can't seem to figure out how to get it to output its energy to anything except for other tech reborn machines. Yeah. It's going to output a redstone signal when our power cell is 50% full or greater. It's not a perfect setup, though, because the buffer in the quarry is still going to fill up to 10 million RF. What I would normally do is I'd I would use an Ender IO conduit, and I would say I'll put only on redstone signal, so then it would only even get RF if it has a redstone signal. That looks really what cool. Do, what do you think about the thing leading up to the bridge thing? I was thinking about maybe oh, having yeah, look at that. The, maybe having it go around the back instead. I don't know. Do you think it looks okay in front? No, I think it looks fine. All right, maybe I'll keep it there then. Yeah. I mean, it blends in really well. You can barely see it. Like, I didn't even notice it until you yeah, mentioned yeah, he's it. He's jumbo puff. Loud. He's yeah. Jump, he's jumbo oh, that was weird. He's made a little progress on his Pokédex. He has nine. I mean, oh. 11. That's the platform ramp, huh? Mm -hmm. That's cool. Is it is it like two separate pieces? The, the frame and then the ramp itself? Oh, a Sea King! Uh, yeah, so the frames yeah, you can put, I think that's what they're called. Yeah, you can put those under if you want. I didn't have to put them under, I just did it because I thought they looked nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is so cool. It reminds me of the railing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it reminds me of like an amusement park. Yeah, that's kind of what I thought of. Well, I'm out of time and I'm going to end here at Arcus M's awesome skull <laughs> base. We got our quarry set up. Uh, I've got canola power now. And in the next episode, we're going to get started on the base build. So I do hope you join me for that. Of course, you, if you have any questions or comments or whatever, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And don't forget to click the like button if you did enjoy this. And to join us next time, thanks for watching.